Hi guys, welcome to my videos. So guys, uh, scammers never stop. Do they? No, they don't. And uh, recently, uh, a piece of news that was published and that was really shocking, where um, somebody was uh, like caught into a huge contract uh, for something that cost very less. And that was not the only case. There has been many such cases and many scams that begin right at your door. So guys, do you know there is a very simple way that can help you? I cannot say that it's going to be like 100 uh, percent system that's going to protect you from all, but at least it's going to help you up to a, 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 a huge extent. And it's a safety parameter too. Like it's very simple thing on your uh, home door. Just put a printout, a message or a card, something that clearly says no solicitations. This really helps guys. Like many uh, door, door to door sellers don't bother me. Realtors don't bother me. It's different if they catch me outside. Like let me tell you what has happened in past week. Like three times when I was outside, I was on my driveway or I was on my walkway doing something. Two times, two realtors who were passing by, they caught me and advertised their service. Once one uh, telephone service or I should say internet service provider caught me, he also advertised his service, but that was outside of my door. Not uh, none of these guys had come to my home and knocked the door. So when you say no solicitation, that's not something foolproof because there are people who deliberately ignore. But still, in most of the cases, people get this instruction that if it's written no solicitation, do not disturb. So that really has helped me a lot. And I'm not saying that all door to door uh, sell pitches are scam. I'm not at all saying that. Many of them or in fact, most of them are legitimate, genuine, but you know, one bad apple hits you and that's it, you are gone. So be very, care very careful guys with this. Like as I've always said, your one signature can just turn your life upside down. Do not sign on any paper unless you understand each and everything. If you don't have time, if you cannot understand, seek help from others. Maybe someone in your family can do read and understand somebody from your friend circle, somebody from your neighbor, or you can even hire somebody legal who can read and understand and give you recommendations that what you got to do. This is going to save you a lot. So you can do that like no, no solicitation, just a printout or something that may help you a lot. So thanks for watching this video, guys. Please subscribe to the channel. Thank you.